crowdfunding is something that has become really, I could say, fashionable in recent years. Why? Because it's an incredible platform for ordinary people to raise funds for all kinds of things, whether it's a cause, whether it's making movies, or even creating inventions. Now, for those of us who don't know, crowdfunding basically works like this. You develop a website, you tell people what the cause is or why you're raising funds, and then whoever is interested in it donates money for you to make this all possible. Well, one Cape Tonian that's managed to raise funds uh, on a platform called Travolta, he raised 45 thousand rand and he's traveling to Uganda to track gorillas and he's right here with us on the show. Chris Caston, welcome to the show. Thank you. Thank you very much for having me. Morning, Lana. I remember us speaking about this on the show, thinking that yeah. it's almost impossible. And I remember it sounded really international. Mm -hmm. This time around we learned that someone in South Africa has actually gone on to do it. Crowdfunding, tell me more. How did you manage to raise an impressive amount of 45,000 rand? I giggle because I'm thinking, <laughs> how is this possible? Tell me yeah, more, take so, me through the whole process. So it's kind of through inspired travel. You know, you have, you have this idea of a trip that you want to take to yeah. really raise awareness about an important issue or to do something extraordinary cool out there. Um, and I was kind of lucky because there's a great platform, Travolta, um, which really is a crowdfunding site. It seems to sort of blend together um, support from a traveling community other people who also enjoy to travel, enjoy to get out there, who can support each other, blend that together with sponsors, so corporate sponsors. Um, yeah. Why did you want to do it? Well, um, I had this idea about going to go trick with the uh, trick with a, um, a group of travel bloggers to go see the mountain gorillas to raise a little bit of awareness around. And there they are. And there they are. There they are. There they are. <laughs> you know, there's less than 880 of them left. They're critically endangered. Mm. Um, we wanted to just tell their story, but then also to look at the communities around the national parks where these gorillas live. Um, because they really benefit from gorilla tourism. And, and that's sort of the message that we wanted to get across. You also offered rewards for people who donated on your site as part yeah. of your experiment in crowdfunding. What were some of the rewards? Yeah, so that's a critical part of it because, you know, if people are donating money, um, it's always nice for them to get something in return. Mm. So, I mean, you can donate as little as one dollar, so ten bucks, really. <laughs> and, and for that, we recognize the people on our, uh, on our Facebook page. Um, and then ten, ten dollars, uh, so a hundred bucks, we send them a postcard from Uganda, <laughs> tell them a little bit, right. they can follow our story. Um, $25 will actually post you a little um, curio or a little gift from Uganda, so you have your own little keepsake for following the trip. Um, up to $75, uh, where, where we chuck in a t-shirt um, with all of the other things that I've mentioned before. And then a little bit later, I'll tell you about what we're doing just for Expresso viewers who want to get ah, involved. Ah, okay. Well, I know that Jane Goodall is in the country. Mm. I, I, I was privileged enough to meet her, and it's amazing to see what she does uh, with her cause and in terms of chimpanzees, how to preserve, how to teach people. Why is it important for you to keep raising awareness about gorilla conservation? Yeah, it's, it's amazing that, that you mention her because it's through people like that and the research that they do um, that we really are in a good position to be able to conserve these sort of iconic species that we have. Um, the great apes, there's quite a few of them, one of them being gorillas, obviously, as well. I mentioned before that they're, that they're critically endangered. Mm -hmm. But also there's, there's conflict between sort of encroaching human settlements mm -hmm. um, and the gorilla habitat. Uh, and, and, and gorilla tourism uh, has really helped to solve that. Um, to a large degree, but we do need to understand them better so that we don't have a negative impact on them. Yeah. Speaking of which, I just mentioned Jane Goodall, and she is on our show, on our Feel Good Breakfast show on Monday. I can't wait, so she's coming to visit. But you're going to miss the interview because you're leaving on Saturday. I'm leaving on Saturday morning, <laughs> yeah. But you're leaving on Saturday, but your, your crowdfunding site will yeah. still be open for all of us to donate. How do we get involved? And you mentioned there's something in it for all of us. Absolutely. So you can definitely get involved. Um, go to the Travolta website, look for the Trekking for the Gorillas tour. I think it's on their landing page. Um, and then, and then click on that, really. The, the, the funding option is open till midnight tomorrow. So midnight on Saturday, you can get in there. Um, so it, all the viewers out there, all the Expresso viewers this morning, um, if you get on there, uh, you donate a dollar or ten dollars or some, whatever it is that you can donate to the tour. When I go to Uganda, I can't unfortunately kiss a gorilla or anything <laughs> like that. You have to stay quite close. You don't want to transfer disease or Could anything like that. Could you whisper Expresso? Just I can, that. I can, I can whisper it, but I'll do even more than that. What would I'm you gonna do? I'm going to go and find some, a, a unique Ugandan delicacy. 
it's a little grasshopper or right. a flying ant, either one of those two. Will you send us gonna, a picture and, and post send, it on our Facebook page? Come I on. I will do, of, of Chris okay. eating I'll either donate grasshopper. I'll if you do that. Will you? Yes. Fantastic. Okay. Done. <laughs> Facebook page, eh? Express Facebook show. Facebook page eating one there of those little grasshoppers. So <laughs> thanks so much and all sure. the best. We're extremely proud of you. And Thank you. Well done. 45,000 rand through crowdfunding. He did it all by himself. Mm. And uh, we wish you well with your travels. Bring back some information. And it's so cool to see crowdfunding campaigns, especially if it's for something good where people can literally change and uh, do some good causes. Well, speaking of things good, there's more amazing stuff happening after the break. This is your Feel Good Expresso show. We'll be back after this.